Good morning. Welcome back to another vlog. I'm going to show you my morning workout routine. If you are new here, I'm Natalie. Sorry if I'm talking quiet. Derek is still sleeping. Cash already jumped out of the bed and he's like, come on, let's go. <laughs> so I'm going to get up and go let Cash out. Well, I let Cash out. Um, I really like to keep the lights off and then turn all the Christmas lights on. I'll show you what it looks like. Ta-da! I love this. Um, after I do that, Cash usually stays out for a little bit in the morning, so I just like make myself a glass of water. And then sometimes I'll eat before I work out and sometimes I just eat after. It just depends on how I feel during that day. Um, I think today I'll just have some water and then after the workout, I'll make avocado toast or something. After I make my water, I'll just sit in this chair right here, look at the Christmas lights, drink my water, wake up a little bit, and then I'll head upstairs and change into my workout outfit. Also, Sometimes Cash won't eat his food unless I sit here with him. Right now, he wants to play. He just got his toy out. But his food is right there. And sometimes I have to sit here and, like, watch him eat. Or else he'll just ignore his food all day. Comment down below if you have a dog or an animal like that. Because I know my mom has one of her beagles. She has to throw him his first couple pieces of food before he'll eat the whole bowl. Like it has to be like a little game or else he won't eat. So some animals are just weird. So let me know what yours is like. Workout time. All right, so we finally made it into the gym. I'm gonna give you a little tour. The gym isn't anything too special but it works. So I'll give you a little tour and then we'll get into the workout. And Cash loves to bring all his toys in here. He's got one right there and his bone right there. And he just hangs out with me in here while I work out. So when you walk in here, we first got this little boxing thing going on. I love using this. This is a great workout. And then we have an elliptical and a bike, a bench, a mat, weights, and then the TRX. And of course, mirrors. All right, let's get into it. Welcome to my workout. So first things I like to do is warm up and it just depends on the day. Sometimes I warm up for 10 minutes and sometimes I warm up for 30. Today was just 10 minutes and I was debating on what to do for a workout because I was really sore. And then I was like, you know what? I'm gonna do TRX and just work out the soreness in my arms. And I really love doing the TRX, so I'm just doing a couple different arm workouts with it just to really work out all that soreness. And then I saw this video on Instagram, and I was like, you know what? I need to try this. So what you're going to see here is me trying something for the first time ever, and I actually feel like I did pretty well at it. So I posted a video of me on Instagram, so here I go trying it. It looks, I don't know if it looks easy or difficult, I'm not sure, but it was kind of difficult. So I did post a video of me doing that on, on my Instagram, and then I decided, you know what, I was feeling really good after the TRX, I was like, my arms aren't that sore, I'm going to lift a little bit of weights, so that's what I did there. And then after that, I did a lot of abs, so I'm just going to fast forward through all of it for you so you don't have to sit here and watch it all at slow speed. After I was done doing the ab workout, I got on the bike and I just did a little bit of a cool down for about 10 minutes. I really like doing this because then I won't be as sore with my legs and also yoga. Yoga really helps at the end of a workout to not be so sore the next day. And after the yoga, I like to do this breathing exercise that my Apple Watch helps me out with. So that's what I'm doing right here. Now that I finished my workout, I grabbed a little snack so I don't get starving while I'm getting ready for the day before I eat breakfast, I eat a snack. I guess you can technically call this breakfast. Um, but look at how cute this little mini banana is. All right, like it was this big. 
so tiny. Okay, I'm gonna take a bath, and why I take baths is because of my arthritis. It seriously helps so much, especially going into this winter time and the cold, it really like can flare up all the inflammation. So these baths really help. But I'm gonna take my bath and eat my banana and then go eat my real breakfast. I'm all ready for the day. Here's my outfit of the day. I'm gonna be wearing just plain black jeans and a plain black shirt, but I'm gonna be wearing this Natalie Decker plaid shirt. I love these. I had these for sale um, on my website not too long ago and they sold out so fast. So comment down below if you think we should make more of these um, or kind of something similar but a little bit different. Let me know down in the comments if you would purchase more of these if I made some because I only have one because they sold out so fast and I want more. So give me an excuse to make more. Now that I'm all ready for the day, I wanted to really quick talk to you before we get going and doing other things. What motivates me to work out every day? And I just want to share with you what motivates me because maybe it can help you and motivate you. Sorry, my watch. Oh, just an email. Sometimes it tells me if I reach my goals. Okay. Well, anyways, so every day I try to spend every day making myself a better person. And on that list of things that I should do mentally for me to know that I'm working towards being a better Natalie is going to the gym and working out. And not just because I'm an athlete and I need to be fit for my job and racing and for what I love to do, but then also just to be healthy, um, especially because I have an autoimmune disease and I've had so many different types of surgeries and procedures and problems with my joints and inflammation, it's so important to stay active and stay in the gym and stay moving. And that really helps me with the pain is to actually get up in the morning and move and get going and working out helps minimize the pain. So not just being an athlete helps me, you know, want to get in the gym and work out and be better for my job in being an athlete but also just to be healthy so like to sum it all up what like so it's not so confusing is every day i just try to be the best self i can be and going to the gym is one of the things that i know is going to help me better myself i just realized the whole time i was talking there was a dog barking i'm so sorry it was our neighbor's dog barking that whole time i hope that didn't annoy you um we are going to the Hall of Fame. Derek's family is in town. So we're going to the NASCAR Hall of Fame. I have never been there. They have never been there. Maybe parts of it will be in this vlog, but if I'm allowed to, I'm going to vlog the whole Hall of Fame and my experience there. Okay, so I'm here. We made it, NASCAR Hall of Fame. They're all right there walking in. Here we are, we're here. In this vlog, I'll show you a tiny, tiny bit of in there and what we're doing, but stay tuned for my next vlog. It will be the whole tour with me. <laughs> that was for the thumbnail. But I made it. Welcome, Natalie. My favorite drivers are Kurt Busch currently and in the past, Mark Martin. But technically, I always say my favorite driver is Martin Truex, but I thought I would switch it up for this. Brady he said he missed a lug, so we're gonna have to redo it to try and top our time. All right, so let's try to beat our time. Here we go. Ready, set, That's Brady and then me, Nat. There we go, 10 seconds. Woo. Go team. So I'm at the NASCAR Hall of Fame here in Charlotte and we're coming through the gift shop as we're leaving and we're looking and admiring all the die casts. All of these are cup cars and the only truck in there is mine. It's my Daytona truck from this year when we finished fifth. How cool is that? I'm upstairs in my bedroom right now, my cute little slippers on, 
and I just finished editing the morning workout routine video and I need to close it out because it is probably nine o'clock right now at night and I'm still filming my morning routine. <laughs> oh. So I'm closing it out now, but before I close it out, I'm gonna insert some clips of the light show at Charlotte Motor Speedway that I went to see with Derek's family and it was amazing. So I'll insert them for you right now. So was that not amazing or what? And that was only a tiny bit of it. All right, well, I need to close this video out now because everybody's downstairs and I want to spend time with everyone and have a fun little game night or something. I don't know exactly what we're doing, but we've been addicted to this game called Monopoly, Monopoly Deal, Monopoly Deal. And it's a card game and it is amazing my brother and his girlfriend laura introduced it to derek and i and now we've been playing it with derek's family but i love you all so much and thank you so much for tuning into this video and if you made it this far in the video comment down below about um let's see about the lights because that was late in the video so comment down below if you love the lights all right, I love you guys, and I will see you in the next video, which will be the tour with me at the NASCAR Hall of Fame. So stay tuned and subscribe and wait for that notification for that video because it's going to be amazing. All right, bye.